with Jerry Butler. Shit! <laughs> Move yourself, man. Lovely, lovely. I can't remember sitting in a couch. Never mind sitting in a couch with the two of you. <laughs> anyway, first of all, I like your suit. Okay, oh, yes, you. love your suit. Much. Right, now that we've got that out of the way. <laughs> um, now, is it true what we've been hearing in the newspapers? Because they say that you're a bit of a stud. Is this, is this the way it is? Yeah. <laughs> Modest no. to a fault. No, not I at all. I think you're quite... Not at all. It's, um, he's quite a dish, isn't he? Um, he's right, I love his hair. But we're not allowed to fondle the guests. We've let, been let him speak. Let him Sorry. answer a question. Go yeah. for it. No, I mean, it is a bit funny, isn't it, that they, they kind of make such a big deal of that. I mean, it's nice, you know, but it's not what it's about, you know, and then you do these interviews and you talk about your work and you talk about, you know, maybe the great actresses you worked with and then it just comes out that you've, you know, how many actresses you get to snog and, and, and stuff. And it's not really about that. And it's a, yeah, just, it's kind of, it's a bit sad so sometimes. It's, it's a bit of an, an insult to them. It's not about who you snog, really, is it? No, no. I'm but not saying that that can't be I know. nice oh, things, I, but see, I've, I mean, I've worked, I've been ask. lucky. I'm dying to what, ask, what, 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 who what? have you snogged? I know that, I know I don't want to put too fine a point oh. on it, but just give us a wee taster. So you're just doing the same as everybody else. I know, I'm really I'm sorry, not but... No, you're not. And you're not. And he's an actor, and he's here to talk about his acting. Okay. Yes. Yes. Right, go, Stacey. Ask about acting, because I'm talking about sex, too. <laughs> <laughs> I know it's what we all want to know about. But anyway, you're also in a new film with Valerie Edmond called One More Kiss. Do you yeah. want to tell us a bit about that? Yeah. Um, it, I'm, I'm so proud of that. You know, it's a, just, it's a lovely piece of work, beautifully mm -hmm. shot, and she is amazing in it. The whole cast, James Cosmo, you know, if you might remember. A brilliant film. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Really? I want everybody to go and see it, because yeah. it's out in Scotland now. <laughs> I have. I've heard it's but really good. It, you know, it's kind of... Because it's about a woman, basically, who comes back with a major secret, you know, which I can tell you, <laughs> because can it wouldn't you? make any sense. Otherwise, yeah, yeah, it's not gonna be. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Jerry's talking crap again, <laughs> um, and she's um, basically comes back to see me and her dad to say she, that she's she's dying of cancer and she only has so much time left, and makes it sound like a quite serious. Like, quite yeah, a but serious it, you know, but it's not. The thing is, for a film like that, it is exceptionally funny and really uplifting because she has decided. I've got, it, it kind of makes you think that you only have this one life and it's actually a very short time and you really need to, you know, make the most of it. And the situation that we're all in as well, you know, because she says, I'm here, I'm dying, I want to spend the rest of my time with you. And I say, oh, well, I'm married, you know. Yeah. I say, what do you do, you know? And, uh, but it's, it's, it's lovely. Well, shall we see a clip of it, which we just happen to have ready? Yeah. Here's a bit from One More Kid. <laughs> A bit of alright acting too, really, yeah. Thank you. But I want to know, I want to know about fast food because that sounds a bit mad. Um, it's about you and a three mates or something that try and well, they think it's a good idea to rob a kebab shop. <laughs> I mean, yeah. was that was that some kind of drunken after night? Hey, let's rob a kebab shop. That'll be a good idea. It's um, yeah, we're basically, you know, it, it's Dougie Henshaw plays the lead in it, and, and he comes back to see his mates. And we, we, were all, we all grew up together, you know, mm -hmm. and we're all, we were all little thugs, but we've turned into small-time gangsters, you know, and he's tried mm -hmm. to make his way in life, you know, running a, a legit business, and it hasn't worked out. So he comes back to see us, and we try to kind of get him into the, you know, like draw him into our, to our little underworld, and we have a big plan, and our big, well, our big plan isn't, we have just robbed a kebab shop, all but right. our big plan is to rob a sweet shop. Oh, <laughs> So, um, it, is, um, it, it just goes from the ridiculous to the sublime. Yeah. Um, yeah. But it's really clever and it was made on like next to nothing, wasn't it? Thank you for bringing that up. <laughs> yes. Yeah. And well, we were late to that. Film <laughs> opens <laughs> in Scotland next week. <laughs> so, Keeping sexy. Right. Yeah, but very good, very good, very dark, very violent, very surreal. And, um, and just mad. And, yeah. Sounds great. It is great. I can't wait. I can't. Well, I've, I've seen it. Can't wait to see one more kiss. And thank you very much, Jerry. Thank that's you. that's our <laughs> 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 Thank you. <laughs> 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 <laughs>